What up gamers, Fence here here, and welcome back to Star Wars The Old Republic. So last time we did a bounty, we got to do a total of three. We did one of them uh, where, yeah, we had to take this guy in. He's a captured rebel, um, but yeah, he was like secretly in love with a imperial noble woman. And yeah, <laughs> uh, we just took him back because he was not supposed to be, you know, away. Or like with that woman uh, but yeah next up we got to do our second bounty um it involves this guy admiral for ball so yeah let's go ahead and see what's up admiral where art thou hello this is Hi. the office of admiral for ball of the imperial navy do you have business here yes get out of my face <laughs> i am a lieutenant in the imperial navy address me with respect or i will have you publicly flogged <laughs> now if you'll excuse me i'm very busy let me in there now. I really couldn't care less what you. What's all that racket out there, soldier? There's a quarrelsome individual here, Admiral. Rather dirty, too. Quarrelsome? You're as weak as you are, stupid. I requested a mercenary from the Mandalorians. Send that person in immediately. Yes, sir. <laughs> you may go in now. I'll bet you get a demerit for that, Lieutenant. <laughs> You're terrible. The Admiral <laughs> is waiting. That was a fun conversation. Hey there, Admiral. So, what do you want from me? Come in, mercenary. I apologize if my secretary caused you grief. He is of low birth and his intelligence reflects it. I'm afraid <laughs> many of our Imperial soldiers are hopeless with delicate tasks. This is, of course, why I asked for a professional. Okay. If it's delicate you want... It's delicate you'll get. I have every faith in the Mandalorian Enclave's ability to get things done discreetly. My daughter has become something of a liability to me. What? I want you to kill her. All right. Um. Ooh, that's a that took a turn. <laughs> that's family. Oh my gosh! But dead daughter. Check. <laughs> Details. My daughter was born Force-sensitive and trained to be Sith. A great honor for our family. Unfortunately, my daughter's master is one Lord Grathen, a madman who is now disgraced in the eyes of the Dark Council. All I need to know is where she is. I applaud your discretion, but I need you to understand the gravity of the situation. If Lord Grathen's compound is raided and my daughter captured or killed, every member of her family will suffer. This is Sith politics. Man. In the best case scenario, I lose my rank and position. In the worst... <laughs> You've got a lot to protect, Admiral. Precisely. There is no room for failure here. Lord Grathen is a paranoid madman. His compound is built to withstand a siege. But a lone infiltrator will take them by surprise. My daughter is somewhere inside Lord Grathen's compound. Her name is Veretta. You will know her as she resembles me closely. <laughs> I'll handle this quiet and quick. Man, do this hey, guy. Hang on, I've been running some data. Turns out Renegade Sith Lord followers rack up death marks like crazy. Lord Grathen's top people all have prices on their heads. Um... Wait, what just happened? Some data turns out Ren Renegade Sith Lord followers rack up death marks like crazy. Lord Grathen's top people all have prices on their head. So are you saying that it's going to be tough? <laughs> Let's collect them all. It'd be a shame to let those bounties go to waste. And we might need those extra credits to gear you up for the big melee. Oh. Remember, discretion is essential. Do not let yourself be captured. Good luck. All right. There's also a bonus. Got to go after the overlords. Hey there, Patrak. <laughs> Screw you, buddy. Okay. Yeah. Oh my gosh, dude. Uh. Yeah. The admiral, man. Oh my gosh, he's like so straightforward. You know, he's like he doesn't think twice. Like he doesn't hesitate. Just saying it straightforward, man. Just. To kill his daughter. <laughs> oh, I mean, I don't know. 
I guess I shouldn't be surprised. But I guess that's just what happens when, you know, you don't really know much about the, I guess, the Imperial or Sith side of things, you know? And like I said, um, you know, stuff like that one upcoming Acolyte show, like, we're finally going to be seeing the perspective of, from like a Sith person. That's something that I feel like, um, I don't know, Star Wars doesn't really ex explore a lot, is like, like the the Imperial side of things. Yeah, that's just something, and it's always still a bit of mystery. It's always Jedi, man. <laughs> it's always the Jedi. But now, I can be a... not a Jedi. And yeah, I know I've probably said that like a thousand times now. <laughs> okay. So yeah, where do we go from here? Oh, wow, we gotta go far. Um... I mean... Should we take this path? I feel like we can also take that, but... Let's go take this. Alright, time to go. <laughs> A horrible person. Weepu McClop. <laughs> McClop? Or McPlop? I can't say that, right? That's a funny title and name. I don't know, should I even fight these guys? Level 12, I mean, I- Look how big this guy is. Yep, there we go. Dang. Some of these guys are already taking some other guys down pretty fast. Dude, Mako's awesome, just- Always healing me up, and also I just miss an item back there. <laughs> uh, for real though, man, it's just... It's just really straightforward, the mission. And that's cool, you know? I like that. I feel like uh, Disney is try trying to go a bit too soft on Star Wars, and this game just... went very dark. <laughs> pretty fast. Definitely helps out with the role playing too, and yeah, I just also love the dialogue, man. Like with the, uh, with my character, because yeah, the choices I'm making, man, has, has been fun. Level thirteen. Oh my. Oh, what? I just went back down. Okay, that guy's down. Man, it does take a while for me to shoot these guys. Got a gun dark over here. But yeah, definitely need to level up. I also saw the Admiral's level too. He was a. Uh... Oh, I'm not pressing on a button. Yeah, he was like a level 16, so. I don't know if that's the level I'm supposed to be at. But yeah, I definitely need to level up too. Like a lot. Alright, come on, Mako. Um. Oh, we got some droids here too? What the heck? All these guys around here. Is this guy that bad to fight? Oh no, this guy's not that bad. Oh yeah, he's not that bad. They're the probe droids. Nice, there we go. Alright, we'll keep on going. Um, yeah, we're on the right track. Hey, we got a friendly place here, too. Nice. Oh, look at this guy. Oh my gosh, is that a whole mouth? I have never seen a creature like that. That's really interesting. We got a stims vendor. See anything you like? Uh, no, but do you see anything that I like? Or I have that you like? Uh, 
Yeah, we'll be selling this. We don't need that now. I really hope I'm doing the right thing, too. Come again. I still don't know if I should give her some weapons, too. If I'm supposed to give her some new ones. Alright. Oh, yeah, we just go over here. Yeah, still not sure about that. You know what? I do need to look that up, probably. Because I... I guess I just still don't understand if... Giving her weapons actually does something, or is it just like... It scales to her level, like her power. Because when I read the tutorial... It said that it doesn't matter if... Yeah, it just doesn't matter. It just said combat effectiveness doesn't affect with the armor and clothes or the weapons, probably. Alright, come on, Mako. I do wonder, though, maybe I can... Because I'm not sure if there's going to be a point where, you know, I might have a hard time with some enemies. I wonder if, uh, maybe, maybe in a few videos that, maybe I'll play this game on my own time and try to level up. Yeah, maybe that'll be something that I do. Just so that I don't have to worry about, you know, being underleveled. But I don't know, I mean, we're also making pretty good progress, too. Am I even going the right way? I need to check on myself. Oh, I'm nuts. I need to go to the... To this side over here. I mean, I don't know. You, you think that's the right way? It's just this way looks like it's going to the actual pathway. Oh. Camera just messed up. So I'll fix now. Oh. Are we at another friendly place? I think so, but it's not like there's a whole camp or something around here. Wait, did I go the wrong way? Oh, we're supposed to go up that hill. Okay. And we also gotta make sure once we get there to defeat those overlords. And I don't really have any new dialogue with her, right? I can't talk to her? We'll talk later, okay? Okay. Yeah, maybe I can talk to her later on about stuff. Oh, you're going down. Do I even... Do I even have better moves? <laughs> I know I keep on spamming the rapid shots, but... It's been doing pretty okay so far. Oh no. We got like two of them over here. I don't know if I can take them out on my... On my own. You think it's worth it? Am I even going the right way? Let's see. I mean, I think so. Okay, we can do it one by one. that cat too. Nice. Hey there kitty cat. Alright, almost done. Dude, that's gonna be so expensive. <laughs> the uh, travel costs, just going back with a taxi. Okay, we found another friendly area. A Revenite warrior. 
You think these guys are, uh... You think they're, like, related to Revan? I mean, Revan Knight. It sounds like Revan. That would be so cool. To learn some history. Am I even going the right way now? Ooh. <laughs> Still uh, a ways off. Okay. I don't know, maybe these guys are like followers of Revan. Oh boy, we just entered a... He looks kind of cozy, but why hold a monument all the way out here? That one? I don't know. It's a level 13 creature right here. Oh my. going there we go how's my inventory by the way okay not that bad yeah we can see we can still keep on going oh wait do I get a lot of experience for that is that good I need to see that again Still the same amount. I don't know why this one. Oh, because of the the codex entry. Yeah, I got a lot of experience for that. <laughs> for that codex entry. So it's like whenever we see someone new. Oh, what is that? Oh, a probe droid. And this is probably not the right way too. Okay, let's go over here now. This over here should be the way. Oh my gosh. Oh, there's so much. Try to go one by one. We don't want to attract everyone right away. Oh boy. This guy? Can I avoid? That feels way too big to avoid for me. I'm almost there. Nice. I am about to level up. Which is pretty good. Jeez. Oh no, wait, is this the dead end? Oh no. What? Oh, that's a big guy over there. Oh no. I don't think this is the way. Oh, come on. Do I gotta go, uh... Yeah, I'm like looking at the map. It looks like a dead end. Oh wow. So it looks like over here then? The other way? Oh well that sucks. You're not sure what going here was all about then. <laughs> oh man. Okay. I think uh, we gotta go back around. But on the plus side, uh, we are about to level up. So it's not that bad of like going over here. What's up, Revanites? You guys look pretty cool. I do feel like you're followers of Revan in some way. That's something too. Like, with this game being pretty expansive in the lore and story... Like... Yeah, I feel like I want to play through this game, like, most of the story content first. Before I even look up any lore with, with this game. I did look up some lore with, um, you know, with the uh, stuff in the Knights of the Republic stuff. But that was only with a few characters, though. 
And I don't I don't think anything was mentioned in like the old republic. I think for me it was mainly Kreia is what I looked up. Ready when you are. And yeah, I didn't see anything with her in the old republic, so I think her journey just pretty much ended. Now why can I not I can't loot that. <laughs> okay. Um the map. Okay, we'll try to go over here this time. Maybe that's the true way forward. Look at that mount. Yeah, I'm guessing over here is the actual way. But I don't know, I could be wrong. <laughs> I thought this was the way. But I gotta do some more exploration. It looks like, yeah, based on that the guy that just passed us, there might be... There might be a... Uh, a taxi around there. Hey, level 13. Nice. Alright. Uh, let's go. I'm gonna guess the front gates is around here somewhere. Yeah, this has to be it, right? <laughs> it's got to be the place. Okay, we're back. In civilization. This must be the front gates. Wait, there's also something over here. A story arc. Sandor? Is this uh Okay. Yeah, is this one of the the Lords? It's also, yeah, it does have the same icon too, like the story stuff. But I just want to make sure. Um, how do I toggle this stuff? Yeah. Okay, yeah, he's he's still part of the story, okay. Hey. Ah, mercenary. Already word of your feats has reached those knowledgeable in Kaas City. I am the apprentice and voice of Darth Charnas. I speak in his name and I would bargain for your services. Um, he's speaking his name. Okay. Um, I am curious. I want to hear more about Darth Charnas. I've never heard of any Darth Charnas. My master prefers to remain in the shadows, but do not doubt his power nor his ability to reward success. I speak for him. I require individuals capable of gaining prestige in a society weaned on secrecy and madness. Individuals who can earn respect, if not love. I need infiltrators to eliminate an enemy of the Sith. You would serve well. Um... What sort of enemy are you referring to? Our enemy is the Order of Revan. <gasps> a cult of fools hidden at every stratum of Imperial society. For years, the Revanite heretics have secretly uh. recruited military officers, powerful Sith, wealthy mercenaries, anyone who can add to their power. Okay. Wow, we... I'm pretty interested in this. The, Yeah, we just passed by the Revanites. The Order of Revan. And it said Story Arc too. Oh man, I, w I wonder if... Okay. I'm guessing this is the part of the story, but... You want me to join them, I take it. I want you to help my master ruin them. I mean, I don't, I don't want to. <laughs> the Emperor and his Dark Council, the Revanites follow a long dead Sith Lord, tainted by Jedi ways. If you can uncover the Revanite leader's identity for us, my master will reveal him to the Dark Council. His destruction would be assured. All you have to do is join the cult. I can get you inside, but you must earn their trust. <laughs> I I really don't like this man. I, I I mean I like I like Revan. Revan is my is actually like ever since I played the first Knights of the Old Republic game, Revan's been my favorite character in Star Wars. So I don't know, I just I don't know how I feel about this. <laughs> I earn their trust. I earn my fee. Is that right? Indeed. The Revanites have a secret compound in the jungle. 
Take this token to the cultist at the entrance. I was just there. He will initiate you. Earn an audience with their leader. When you have seen his face, return here, and you shall have your reward. Oh man, I mean, if that's it, then... Wow. Wait, we got two different... Okay. This feels like a whole separate thing. What if what happens if I abandon it because I don't know, I feel like I wanna stick with my Yeah, it looks like the class story. I need to look this up at some point. The uh the Droman Kass, this thing. But yeah, I just wanna stick with my class stories. <laughs> I mean that that's really interesting. Um I hope that if I abandon it, that I can just like redo this quest for more to like revisit the exposition. Well, yeah, this feels like a whole different storyline that I don't know. <laughs> yeah, that's something that I need to probably look into. But for now, I want to stick with my job. But yeah, that really does. Uh, it really has my interest. Oh, look at that. So I'm guessing, uh, yeah, we just go here. Dude, it's gonna get so confusing. Just over this bridge. We don't want to get trapped there. Everything I've dug up about grappling is seriously disturbing, even recently. Okay. Yeah, let me go in and just untrack this one. I don't want to get distracted. Oh. Uh. Okay, these guys are bad now. Oh my. Dude, look at that assassin droid. That dude's pretty tall. Cool, cool. Um, fire on that. Right there, the guardsman. Nice. Uh, we got some guys over here too. It is not hitting the, uh, the patrol droid over here. Nice. Uh, we are almost there. I might just end the video there then. If we're getting close. Because, yeah, a lot of time has already passed. Oh, shoot. Uh, let me take care of these guys first. This guy has a lot of health. Nice. There we go. Yeah, that guy had a, had a lot of health. All right. So yeah, I should probably just find some kind of safe place to be at. Maybe in the middle of everyone over here. <laughs> yeah, I think we'll definitely just stop over here in. Oh, I don't know. What time is it? Okay, yeah. I mean, maybe we can go for one more run. Oh, look at that agent just spawning in like that. Oh, okay. not clicking. Okay. Nice. 
All right, guys. So, yeah, I believe that's going to be it for now. Uh, next time, we'll deal with the daughter. <laughs> we're, we're, like, getting really close. Oh, that's such a dark turn with the Admiral, man. But, yeah, um, that'll be it for now, guys. That's game.